How to buy and sell or trade NFTs with Trust Wallet. Hello everybody, welcome back to my channel. This is me, Pippin Bisnet, and today I'll guide you on how you can buy and trade NFTs with Trust Wallet. Well, first things first, you want to go ahead and open up Trust Wallet. Once you're on the wallet itself, what you want to do is you can go ahead and you want to tap on the browser tab. Now in my case, you can see at the bottom, the discover option at the bottom right corner, so you want to tap on it. Once you're at the search bar, what you want to do is you want to type in OpenSea. So you can either type in OpenSea or you can type in OpenSea.io. I'll recommend you to type in OpenSea.io and you'll be headed to this page here. Now from the search bar, you can easily search in for the particular NFT that you are looking to purchase. So you can select it and once you select it, you can tap on it and open it up, right? Once you open it up, you'll get two different options to buy it and to make an offer. Now, if you want to buy it, you can buy it directly or if you want to make an offer, you can simply tap on make offer and then go ahead and make the offer. Before doing so, you'll have to log into OpenSea. You can log in using Wallet Connect, MetaMask, Coinbase Wallet or you can have more wallet options as well as you can see here. So I'll just use the particular wallet. So once you're logged in, you'll be able to buy it and you can go ahead and perform NFT trade as well. Now, let me just log in here. So as you can see, you can set see the price here you can set the price and you can select quantity duration and then you can make the offer once you make the offer what you can do is you can go ahead and you can see if the trader has accepted the offer now if you have any nfts then you can simply go ahead and select the particular nfts that you own and then tap on sell and go ahead and sell it or add it to the market so this is how you can buy and trade nfts with trust wallet hope this helped you do like and subscribe and do not forget to leave a comment down below if you have any further issues